Welcome to the KM8000 Hotbox Diesel Control Panel Operational Video. Uh, we're just going to be going over uh, some of the brief components and the brief operation of it. Um, on the exterior, you'll notice that it's equipped with an e-stop and a main battery disconnect. Inside, we have a HMI human machine interface and toggle switches to control various operations of the panel. To start the operation, turn on the main battery disconnect. The screen will illuminate and begin a loading screen, which, which will take about 45 seconds to go through. Once your screen is loaded, your default screen will be that asphalt temp temperature, which is function one, displayed underneath on the laminate. The next two functions of function one are asphalt set point and combustion chamber temperature. And you can cycle through those screens just by simply pressing F1. F2 brings you to the battery voltage voltage screen. F3 will bring you to a resettable runtime. The runtime can be reset by pressing the enter button and holding. Depressing F3 again will bring you to a total runtime which is not resettable. F4 is your on delay timer. This is a timer to delay your in initiation cycle by 168, 0 to 168 hours. After, once we get all that completed, we'll go back to the asphalt temp screen on F1, and we want to set an operational temp to a desired temperature, normally roughly between 300 and 350 degrees for a hot mix, and 90 to 120 for cold mix depending on manufacturer spe specifications. So currently I have a set point of 300 either using up and down arrows in increments of 5 or using the increase decrease set point toggle switch over here we'll do, which will do the same. Once you hit your desired temperature if you want to on delay if you want to start in the morning 12 hours later from the point of setup we go to on delay, set it to 12 hours. Once that set point has been reached, simply enable your burner. It'll say on delay is active, and it'll count down for 12 hours and then initiate the burner until the burner has reached the 325 degree set point. If a on delay is not required, simply decrease it or leave it at zero. Ensure that your asphalt set point is to the required setting and then enable burner. And you will enable the burner. To disable your burner, simply flip the switch to disable, allow the burner to go through its post purge cycle of 30 seconds,
and then power off. <laughs> 